Taylor Swift revealed during her second night performing in Paris that she has been working on the Tortured Poets Department segment of her era's tour since last year. The 34-year-old singer, who has revamped her record-breaking tour, took a moment during her show to share details with her attentive audience. We started planning this surprise for you about eight or nine months ago and then when we got two months off of the era's tour, we really didn't take any time off at all. We just went directly back into rehearsals. So I'd like to give it up for my crew, my dancers, and my band, she said during a break in the music. The Tortured Poets Department was released on April 19th and is Taylor's 11th studio album. Swift returned to her tour in style on Thursday as she unveiled new outfits on stage in Europe. Fans went wild as the global megastar pulled out all the stops with her high-energy performance. She treated the audience to an edited setlist, with six songs replaced by new tracks from TTPD. There were also new costumes during the three-hour show. Taylor made an entrance in a white taffeta Vivian Westwood dress with a corseted bodice. It also boasted dramatic hip draping and her lyrics, I love you, it's ruining my life, were printed on the skirt. Before performing The Smallest Man Who Ever Lived, a track from her new album, she wrapped a matching white trench coat around her. Later in the show, Taylor showed off her figure in an orange and pink jeweled bodysuit, it was teamed with matching knee-high boots as she performed at the Paris La Defense Arena, fans went wild over her first European performance, with one posting on X, she just blew our minds, I cannot get over the fact that in the middle of a tour she managed to completely add an entire new section with choreography, props, costumes. During the middle of the tour, literally no one works harder than Taylor Swift. Taylor is set to perform four nights at the Paris Arena and then will head to Stockholm, Lisbon, Madrid and Lyon before taking the production to the UK.